One, nope. <laughs> Fucked it up already. One, four, oh, eight. I really wish the uh, inventory sounds. Buddy, this is a test of skills, so no cheating. That shit you're carrying, get rid of it. Okay, got some special items. But uh, yeah, I wish the inventory sounds in this game would be the same as they are on that keypad. Because, you know, classic Resident Evil sounds. They make me happy. So that's the first time I'm forced to use the uh... Have a nice day. the item box. I'm gonna be using it later on. Oh wait, I have to trigger the thing first. Great. Then that's gonna pretty much blow up into my face. Come on, come on. I know. Come on, come on, let me. Now, don't stand too close to that one when it goes on. When playing as as a uh, clan, see, you can get close to that because it turns on normally, but playing as Ethan, it does not. So that should be a, an easy thing to do here. The password is loser. Thank you. And get the valve the valve in the place where you need to put it so you can light up the cake easy puzzles are easy I was like at the beginning when I started uh, recording this I said that I wasn't entirely sure if I would remember how to do this without any troubles but apparently I was so that should be fine yeah. it's weird that Ethan stays here looking at the cake that's eventually gonna blow up because it starts ticking you should think ahead and you've already seen this on tape or well if you watch the tape you should know Motherfucker. yep uh, give me that break that throw it in and Lucas is fucked Screw you, Lucas! Hmm. That's gonna take a sweet time. I would probably remember the code of that one too, without actually checking it. But I don't need it because it's an item that's not used here. D-series head, great. I should probably save my game now. Check my time real quick. It's 2.07. That's a good time. And save my game here. Let's just save here. Sure, as the main house save, so I have to save separate from each other in case I fuck things up, which I don't think I am going to do. Okay, I should probably get the special handgun, get the infinite ammo, get the grenade launcher, shotgun, and no, I don't need the handgun. Uh, the knife I don't need. The uh, ammo I don't need. This here is arm. That is something I do need. Uh, the crank, the crank. I do need the crank. That's uh, let's take the herbs too. The secrets of defense. Well, I don't need that because that's that. Uh, we're on easy mode. 
I should not be in your way in any way. And we're out here. And this is why you needed to crank. You always need it until the boat part, which is gonna be a pain! Oh Christ. So we're just going to use the crank here. Annoyingly, it's gonna be sticking to my inventory for quite a while still. But it should be okay, because I don't need any extra ammo. I can just waste all the bullets I can. Cause it's infinite. Like... I don't know, I was gonna say life, but life is not infinite. We're all gonna die at some point. Oh man, now this video got sad. <laughs> I was gonna say, now this stream got sad, but I'm not streaming this, I'm just recording a video. Run, Ethan, run! Too bad I don't have the running shoes yet. You can only get the running shoes after being in the game under four hours. Which is something I'm trying to do here. Yep, that's the Albert gun for ya. Crazy damage. Oh shit, I pr should probably have gotten the burner. Oh well, I've got the... Uh, grenade launcher with the fire ammo. So I don't need any of that shit. Yep, keep using the crank. To crank your way to victory! And so we go. Forward, into the night. Hi, bye. That was fast. I got the infinite ammo just to make this ending go a little bit faster. Because I need all the fasts that I can get. Fuck you. Oh, he didn't even die. Oh well, now he's dead anyway. Still probably should have get, get gotten the uh Oh shit, what do I need that for? Anyway, she still should have probably gotten the uh the uh knife just to make these item swaps go faster. I mean the item pickups, not fucking item swaps. Ah, uh, sometimes I don't even listen to myself. Okay, Zoe, let's let's do this. Zoe? Zoe, uh... Not now. We don't have the time. Do you have both ingredients? Right here. There should be enough, right? If we make them fast enough, my father and Lucas aren't far away. He's coming. Daddy's coming. Oh. Good. Oh, that's so hot. Keep saying that. Okay, let's get this over with. Okay, Mia, I'm gonna help you out. So after we make the serum, what's next? We have the boat outside. We'll take it through the swamp. But now the vessel will get very far without the serum. 
Okay, give me those, give me those, give me those. Give me. Hey! Thank you. One of those is mine. Hello, daddy. Daddy O. I mean, Jack, I you've seen better days, seriously. Get this skin condition like dealt with. Think you should need a doctor? Ah! Go meet a doctor. I have my doctor's phone number. I can give it to you. If you so wish. Oh. Shot myself a little bit there. That's okay. This is getting old, Jack. Yep. It really is. I would play Captain Jack in the background of this fight if it wasn't copyrighted. <laughs> Continuous damage is what I do. Oh, fuck you. Oh, even the Albert 01 is not doing enough damage. Or maybe the fire is doing its thing. Well, I'm not even looking. So now the place <laughs> starts burning up. Probably not anything to do with me. Don't hit me too hard. I hit myself hard enough. Okay, where are the rest of the eyes? Is there one in your arm? Not sure. Oh, there's one in your back. Oh, he's slowed down by the uh, ice rocks. I shot, I think. That's good. Okay, where is the last eye? Was that the last one? Or was there still one on your belly? Did you climb up a little bit so I can... I can oh, you. Ew, stop pushing me around. It's disgusting. Oh yeah, there was one on your belly. Should probably... Do a quick swap. Those... Oh shit. Somewhere around there. Maybe I should invest in using the uh, ice rounds just to slow him down a little bit. When he gets back up. Yeah, fuck you too, Jack. Fuck you too. Ah, uh, nobody likes you, you fucking piece of shit. I say that sarcastically, I mean... Jack as a character is amazing. He's one of my favorite Resident Evil characters in recent years. The uh, stuff he says to Ethan is just hilarious if you just sit around and listen. Fuck's sake. Come on, climb up. Time to uh, try to find the missing eye. There it is. Oh, there it goes. Too bad for you, Jack. Too bad for you. I'm gonna load my guns. Okay, that should be enough of that. You just come on, come on. Open the door. I've seen everything. Hello, Zoe. 
Ethan, this way. I try. Yes. He's my daddy, I want him to be cured. I mean, what kind of a life would Jack lead if that actually cured him? <laughs> if he had to live as a monstrosity like that. You know, instead of calcifying or whatever. Come on. Are you alright? Yes. You just yeah. get the fuck out of here. What's my time, by the way? Ooh. Ahead of time. Now, it's an obvious choice that I have to do here. An obvious choice that was so easy for me on my first playthrough when I played on normal. Uh, on Madhouse, I chose Mia, which was obviously the better choice. And, you know, for skipping cutscenes, uh, curing Mia is the right choice here. Uh, because then you can skip the whole Mia boss battle, that's... That would otherwise be Both at the end of the game. Go. Sorry, Zoe. I'm, I'm sure there's someone who can help. This is my home. Apparently, I belong here. Like the way she says that. Okay, but right. Don't bother. There won't be anyone left to help. This is kind of sad, though. But I do like that there are multiple endings, like Resident Evil direly needed that, in my opinion, because I really liked Resident Evil games when they had multiple endings back in the day. They gave a lot of replay value. Uh, then again, I played Resident Evil two, uh, 5 and 6 multiple times, just for the trophies. So I guess that's the replay value of games nowadays, but I still haven't gotten Platinum in either of those <laughs> but that's mostly because I gave up with Resident Evil 6 because it has so many trophies uh, it's a fun game but I just don't want to be playing it through so many times just for the trophies uh, with Resident Evil 5 I otherwise would have gotten all the trophies because I actually do like Resident Evil 5 it's one of my favorite Resident Evil games I know it's yeah. weird but I know you've been through a lot. it's a thing it has great co-op and I like that yeah, it's kind of like an end of an era with Albert Wesker dying. Oh no, spoilers! Uh, but true. yeah, that's that's a thing. Ethan, I honestly don't remember. I otherwise would have gotten all Resident Evil 5 trophies up until the Platinum trophy, but my PlayStation 3 died, and so did my saves with it. And it sucks because Sony doesn't let you just use the same. Same hard drive for another PS3 to continue your games. No, they're hard locked to that one PlayStation 3, and you know, if you saved your games on that and it died, then you're fucked. You should have made copies of those saves, which I did on a memory card that disappeared somewhere. I was so pissed. My PlayStation 3 dies, and the memory stick I just say memory card, the memory stick I used to store my copied saves. It disappeared too. So that was just a double punch in the nutsack.